Today is February 22nd, 2015. Yes, it is raining outside. My pond is filling up and it's going to get freezing by tonight. And by tomorrow, it's going to be all ice. But uh, yeah, it's temperatures dropping towards uh, freezing by uh, sun go down tonight. So I'm inside the cozy house and what I'd like to show you is my indoor aquaponic at this point. Everything's nice and green. It's growing. I replaced my uh, um, basil to uh, watercress. This is more uh, uh, applicable for this uh, not so tall space up here. So I've been mowing these down every uh, every three days or so and uh, eating myself uh, watercress. Um, they're very good. It's mild taste of wasabi, peppery and very uh, fresh right off the table. And, uh, <clears throat> and this other grow bed I recently pulled out all my basils and <clears throat> now you know this has been about about three and a half weeks ago, I put a few of these clippings from here to there, and now they are start taking over the bed. That way, I could eat every other day, maybe. It may be every day. It all depends. But yeah, my watercress here is growing rapidly. Just it's all because my 240 gallon tank has a lot of um, uh, cichlids. Uh, they are babies that grew from last year. Some of them are pretty big. Um, I already took out about uh, 50 fish of them, uh, of these uh, batch, and still look about the same. Um, they really haven't, uh, <clears throat> I mean, it doesn't look like I took out 70 of them, but I did. I uh, took it to the pet store and some Craigslist and selling it and all that stuff. Um, but uh, yeah, the fish um, doesn't seem like it, it reduced any number. Yep, <clears throat> it's kind of hard to see. You might see myself on that reflection there. Yeah. Um, yeah, I need to market these fish. They they tend to. Um, overcrowd the tank the whole time and harassing my plaque, plaque right there. So, and they've been eating like a pig. But keeping up with them, my watercress is doing their job to keep the fish healthy and, and you know, uh, growing. 